to save your small businesses in this room. Everybody interested in that? Well, I'm interested in that too, and our team is interested in saving your businesses. Because right now you're under attack. And let's face it, you've been under attack for a long, long time now. You've had, you've been discriminated against when it comes to pricing. You've been discriminated against by the fines that you are getting every single day in your stores. Disproportionate amount of fines. And what is the purpose? The purpose is to put you out of business. It's a conspiracy between these large beer franchises, these franchise distributors that are owned by far that are owned, by the way. They're foreign owned companies looking to put you out of business. What they would like, they would like to see all the beer and all the product and all the milk and all the cigarettes and all the electronic cigarettes and the eggs being delivered by Costco and Walmart and, and Target and every big store. Let me tell you something. Anyone who's a New Yorker knows that New York is made up of small businesses like your companies. You have a right to exist, and everybody who lives in the neighborhood of New York City understands that they need the local bodega, and the local convenience store, and the local supermarket to survive. So we have to stand together, and we have to march to Albany, we have to march to the city council, we have to go wherever we need to go to tell our elected representatives that you do matter, that you are important people, that you are part of the fabric of New York City. New York City is made up of a lot of small little towns. It may be a big town, but it's made up of a lot of small neighborhoods. And you are the lifeline for the small neighborhood. You are the reason why, when you keep your stores open for 24 hours a day, that someone's able to get baby formula in the middle of the night. And our elected officials need to understand that we stand together for the bodegas, for the small convenience stores, against the big giants, and against the big franchise distributors, because they don't have a right legally in this country to discriminate against you when it comes to pricing, when it comes to the fines, and it's happening because we need to stand together as one voice. And if we do that, and we go to City Hall, and we go to Albany, and we let them know that you do matter, we will change the day in New York City, and the bodega will survive to live another day. Thank you very much.